Hello, welcome to Anselm Griffin's continuing series of MATLAB tutorials. This is part one of a two-part tutorial about the watershed algorithm. But before we look at the watershed algorithm, we want to look at BWDIST, so, because that is a fundamental part of the watershed algorithm. So, what I did was I wrote a MATLAB script. Uh, the script was actually taken from the MATLAB help site, but just published it on YouTube here. And we created um, a simple array here. So we look at it here. So in case I go into the commands are there, and if you can stop the YouTube video if you want to look at it there. So there is the image, and the f in the first one where we get on the first one here, just so we scroll up a bit, we get BW1, and we get the Euclidean distance. So if we're here. So there's the image, and say, so the Euclidean distance for where I'm highlighted here is 0, up 1 is 1, down 1 is 1, 2. Left here, 1. Diagonally here, that's just a diagonal distance, and we sort of do the a Pythagoras, a square root of 2, and the square root of 2 is 1.412. If we look over here, that's OK, that's 1. That's the square root of 2, etc. So I think that's OK. We also get L. So what we're saying here is L is 7 and 19. So if we just go back to the original image, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So that's 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, and 19. So this says these, this pixel is nearest to this one. So the 7th are nearest to 7 and the 19th are nearest to 9. <laughs> okay. Now the next one up, uh, so Euclidean is the default, the next one is city block. So here's the city block results. And city block, you can only use uh, left, right, and up, down. So one left, one up, that's a distance of two. Uh, this one here, one right, one up, distance of two. And the three here, we start from here, one up, two up, three up. The four here, we start from here, one right, one up, one up, and one up. And that gives me a distance of four. Next one up that we did is chessboard. And here's chessboard. So what we're saying here is you can move diagonally as well. So we start at zero, go down one, and then move over to there. So that is two moves, so that is a distance of two. If we look at this three here, go down one, down two and across one is three, so that gives me the um, the chessboard. And the last one that we did is the quasar Euclidean, okay. And I gave the formula here; it's down here somewhere. There's the formula for the quasar Euclidean. <coughs> Excuse me. And there's the results for the quasar Euclidean. It's kind of, it's very like the Euclidean distance. You'll be able to work out in detail here uh, how the distances are calculated from the formula here. Now we did a two-dimensional uh, BW dist, and we created a number of images here, 200, and we created. This is logical, so zero is black and one is white. So we did 50, 50 is white, 50, 150 is white, and 150, 100 is white. So we got D1, D2, D3, D4, they're the distances. And then we use the function IM contour to plot the contour distances, and we've got four results there. So for Euclidean city block, a checkerboard, and a quasi Euclidean. <coughs> Excuse me again, slight cold to me today. And to then we did a three dimensional uh, distance here. You can sort of see the results here. And we can set 
the, the camera light and all those functions etc but the important thing here is we have D1, D2, D3, D4 the four distance uh, measurements and we display them there okay so thanks very much thanks for listening